So today we're going to look at how we can remove this watermark. We've only used HD footage to create this, yet somehow we still have the watermark. No effects, nothing else. But the export profile or the export preset that we've selected has caused the watermark. We're going to go through all the profiles that you can use without the watermark and highlight the ones that will include this watermark. So stay tuned. Don't forget to hit subscribe if this is your first time here. Let's get straight into it. Last time in HitFilm, we looked at how the resolution of the import media, so the media that you use and drag onto your timeline in HitFilm, affects whether you get a watermark or not in your exports when you export the final video file. Today, we're going to focus on output resolution, so the export resolution and the different options you've got and how that can then up affecting your overall final video and whether you get a watermark on it or not so we are going to use this river hd clip so as we found out last time hd clips anything up to 1920 by 1080 pixels can be used so up to hd 1080p can be used without a watermark so if we press play We've simply got the video here that we used last time, HD River video. We're traveling over the forest and then into the water. So a really simple video. We're not going to add any sound on or add any effects on so that we don't complicate it. So we know that everything we do is relating to our imports and our exports. So if we take the River HD clip and drag it onto the timeline there and we go to the viewer, this is the preview of our final video now. And if we press play, we can see we've got the same video that we've got on the left hand side previewed in the right hand side so that's as simple as it gets for the video if we now go on to the export tab you'll notice that we've got different default presets here so we're going to use the maximum preset that we can use the 1080p hd for youtube preset and we're going to start exporting this to a file now so for the file name we're just going to put test and we'll put 1080 p and press save that'll start the export we can see in the preview here there's no sign of a watermark being added there and the progress is carrying on it will be reasonably fast for such a short video and then once we open that video we can see quite clearly that it is playing with no watermark whatsoever so that's it simple as that what we're now going to do is we're going to change this default preset so if we lower it to facebook 720p hd so something that's not full hd and we press export again then we'll expect similarly so we'll do test but we'll do 720p this time because it's less than 1080p we will still expect this to export without a watermark it will export faster as well because it is a lower quality video that is finished now so we'll go and take a look at it and here we've got the 720p version the facebook preset playing and again we can see we've got no watermark as we would expect we're now going to look at the presets and this time we're going to change to YouTube 2160p which is ultra high definition. Now high definition full HD 1080p is the maximum that you can use in HitFilm Express without a watermark and we can test this now by exporting to 2160p UHD and exporting the same video this time we'll call it test 2160p and press save this will take a little longer to export because it has got a higher resolution so here we're looking in the preview screen already we can see a big hit film banner across there so don't forget we have still just used a full hd input video so last time we looked at how the input source or anything that you drag in from the media tab can affect the watermark this time we're looking at the export. So even if you only use full HD footage, if you export into something that's higher definition, we're going to see what happens with the watermark. Once we open the test 2160p file, the first thing we'll notice again is this massive hit film banner. So we've got that across there now on our videos. So it's really important to make sure you select YouTube 1080p or below so 1080p or below is critical hope that helps don't forget to hit like on the video and subscribe for more hit film videos we'll see you later